you know, it's almost poetic, you know, we, we start the video off with an error code. Normally, I can get my intro in before we get hit with an error code, but this time, it's a little bit different. We start off with an error code, y'all boys. Anyways, yo, what is good with y'all boys? My name is Fana, and welcome to the channel if you're brand new here. If you already been rocking with your boy, welcome back to another video, my man. Now, for today's shenanigans, we're going to be rocking the Sunbreaker Super. Now, it's been a while since I've actually used it consistently in PvP, just because of all the shutdown supers. You got Thunder Crash, you got bubble and those are kind of the main things for titan to use yeah this video is gonna be pretty laid back we're using fate bringer because i honestly don't think i've ever done a video on fate bringer yet i use it a whole bunch i mean my kill counter really doesn't reflect that but i mean i do enjoy using it i ain't gonna lie though this video might be on the shorter side because i was playing basketball and dude i got fouled so hard i went up for a layup right it was just a regular schmiggler layup now, the dude that's in question, he was feeling some type of way because his team was single-handedly getting manhandled by me, but, you know, that's besides the point. But, yo, this man undercut me, and I fell straight on my freaking back. I got the layup, though. It was an and one. Don't get it twisted. We, we still got the bucket. Yeah, I landed on that concrete. Now, nothing's broken or nothing, at least that I can tell. Like, you know, my back, it's, it's really just my muscle that's kind of bruised and whatever. So, we're going to try to hit up a uh, massage palace this, uh... This weekend i literally feel like an old man i'm literally walking around like i'm freaking 70 years old now basketball isn't inherently a hyper physical sport but sometimes you get those people who just you know they, they turn it into like a wrestling contest for some freaking reason ew 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 that's tough i ain't gonna lie Wow, I get a highlight and you kick me off the game. That's how we're feeling. Wow, Bungie. Wow. Now, I've had people try to help me with my whole error code situation I've been having. I mean, dude, I've literally reset my router. I have a hardwired connection. I even switched to a wireless connection just to see if there was some foolery going on. I've gotten a new freaking Ethernet cable to plug up into my uh, computer and everything. I mean, I, I've done it all, man. I, I've done it all. I mean, I checked my internet speed, called the internet provider. I mean, everything is working the way it's supposed to. It's just for some freaking reason, whenever I try to play Destiny, all kinds of foolery happens. Any other game I play, Call of Duty, Apex, you know, I have no problems whatsoever, you know, lag-wise. Destiny, for some reason, it's just, you know, it's a regular occurrence now. You know, it used to happen every once in a while when I used to get error codes, but something happened at the beginning of this year i don't know if bungie got pissed at me freaking roasting them or something i don't know but yeah like i was saying though it was hilarious yeah i sat there got undercut and this man sat there and looked at me like he didn't just straight up rko me bro and here's the thing man i'm really not a confrontational person because you know probably a couple years ago when i was in high school or fresh out of high school i probably would have got up and spiked the ball off a dude's face but now i'm kind of in like a calmer you know, we're in a calm era. You know, getting a assault charge right now just won't really do your boy any good, okay? Having a felony at my age, that's just not really gonna help your boy out. I'm not gonna lie to you. I really gotta think, okay, if I were to spike the ball off this dude's face, okay, and then just having a background and you know with boxing and fighting and everything like that, would it be in my best interest to literally lay this dude out? over basketball i got erico baboon all right we're just racking up the entire zoo today I, I'm, I'm gonna try restarting my game to see if this helps but honestly i, I don't know what to tell y'all man we literally played like five seconds worth of freaking gameplay but you know honestly as young men and as young women within this society we do gotta conduct ourselves a little bit better sometimes i ain't gonna lie I do so like whenever I'm playing basketball I find myself playing with a lot of like you know 17 16 year olds who are probably in high school sometimes and you know when I hear their conversations bro honestly I, I don't I, I really hope I wasn't like that when I was in high school I don't remember being that brain dead of a person but you know just listening to them it's just like I was losing brain cells. I mean, don't get me wrong, it wasn't the finest group of 17, 16 year old high schoolers I've been around. You know, there are definitely plenty of guys who are younger than me who are, you know, who carry themselves very well. Dude, when I tell you their conversation consisted of who smashed the most chicks, who could beat who up in a fight, and who got the most money. And, and, and that's literally all it was. And I'm just sitting there like, holy. I ain't saying they need to have some thought provoking conversation, but god dang, when I tell you my brain was melting, man. I look, I get on this freaking godforsaken map, and now the error codes are going away. I'm not having connectivity problems, but when I get on a map that I actually like, oh yeah, we're having connection issues left and right.
and I jinxed myself. Alrighty then. I really don't know what to tell y'all boys. I restarted my game. I redid my Aaron at little router thing just one more time just to be sure. And I just keep getting hit with error codes. I really don't know what to tell y'all, man. I honestly apologize. Yeah, this is probably just a sign though. Oh, look, one moment. Due to increased traffic login services. All right, well, this game just doesn't work anyway. All right. And it's funny because nowadays it's almost frowned upon. I say nowadays like I'm freaking, I'm not even old, but you know, nowadays it's really frowned upon to walk away from a fight you know what i'm saying like if you were to sit there and get into a confrontation let's say you're out at a bar or something like that you are in public and you accidentally bump into somebody right they push you they get in your face you know they say something crazy to you honestly sometimes man and you know i, I told people this all the time some fights are just not worth your freaking time man because i'd be at the basketball court sometimes man and these dudes be sitting here getting each other's face trying to like you know start fights over literally the dumbest thing ever it's literally over pickup basketball something when, like you know no so here's a prime example right so i remember i was playing at this park and you know the park that i was at, it has like four different courts and everything so you know i was in the court that was it was one of like the two courts that were in the middle basically now for some reason there was this older dude you know he was probably about like 60 50 something i really don't know it was someone's uncle that was out there and he got mad because me and my boys were hoping on the goal that he quote unquote always hoops at okay apparently he owns that goal he has street cred to it whatever the case may be so me being me i was like because i know how some of my boys are you know my boys they are quick to you know kind of get into conflict for absolutely no reasons i tried playing mr diplomatic and i kind of learned my lesson this dude you know i was telling him like hey look it's all good man just chill because it was kind of barking back and forth but i tried you know reasoning with them and my reasoning ended up me just getting you know a whole ball of water just doused on me so i was just like well that's uh that's great. Now, had this been anybody else, the dude probably would have got dropped right on his head, and that probably would have been the end of that. Someone probably would have caught a charge that day. Now, when it happened, you know, there was some random people that were around there were like, oh, you're going to let him do you like that? You know how crowds get, man. You know what I'm saying? They were trying to hype it up and whatever. But keep in mind, this dude was like, you know, probably like 55 years old. I mean, this is a legitimate old man. And I had two options. I was like, look, we can just walk it off, walk to a different court. No problem. I got another shirt in my bag. It's not that big of a deal. Or I can get my five minutes of fame, lay this dude out, just lay into him till the cops show up, and I get locked up, and now I got an assault charge in my case. So, you know, it's just like, yeah. Now, especially as, like, gentlemen, too, like, you guys got to understand, as soon as you try to get physical, or as soon as you, like, get involved with something like that, it's almost all escalation unless you walk away. Once you retaliate, that that's it. You know, someone's liable to pull out a weapon, knife, gun, whatever the case may be. It's straight escalation from there on and therefore. So if it's not in a situation where it's just purely self-defense or something like that, or you're helping someone out, or you're protecting somebody, honestly, you could just walk away from it. You'll be perfectly fine. And trust me, I'm aware that we're kind of in an era of degeneracy where walking away from a fight, you know, people will sit there and call you less than a man or less than a woman for, you know, not beating somebody up but just think about it do you understand how many people are literally in prison because they sat there and swung on somebody out of like disrespect or something stupid here's the thing if you do any kind of martial arts whether it's like boxing you know taekwondo any kind of mixed martial arts training it is well understood that you could punch somebody one time one one punch to the head you know bare knuckle to the head you know there is a chance that you can punch somebody in their head they could have an aneurysm and quite literally die and that's definitely why i have the temperament that i do have like you know to this day and it kind of my temperament kind of just applies to anything whether it's just like you know a stressful situation school work whatever the case may be yeah this video is finna turn into like a purely commentary video i don't know what the heck is going on tonight with bungie or in, in their servers and everything but this is ridiculous man i don't know what to tell you well um the plan was to get some sunbreaker gameplay in for you guys to get some entertaining flashy gameplay but honestly this game just doesn't feel like working for me tonight so uh yeah we go in the video there um that was we had some life lessons with fana and uh yeah y'all y'all take it easy man because this game just doesn't work that's tough